What's going on everybody? Welcome to the beatmajors.net. Today's video is going to be pretty pretty short today. Um we're going to get into the more FL um side of things. This time we're going to talk about how to uh set up a custom template in FL Studio. Um basically a template is just something just a starting point when you're starting with a new beat or you're starting with a new uh mix or you know you like your uh fl to start up with certain sounds already maybe a piano maybe a synth or maybe a drum you know drums or you know whatever sounds or whatever plugins you like so today i'm just going to kind of show you how to uh set that template up right in the fl studio that way every time you go to open it up it will be everything that you like will be right there so um for starters i'm gonna go over here start off with something simple so we'll go with uh go with gladiator where's gladiator so we're going to start off with gladiator here um this is one you know that we'll start off with um like gladiator we'll find some more drum sounds that um that you know we like we'll find some sounds here that you know just put some sounds in here All right, so let's say, you know, this is uh, our template here where we, you know, these are the sounds that we like, right? So every time you open FL Studio, of course, you want to um, use these specific sounds. So basically, you go up here, you hit save as. Um, you can save it in a specific spot that you'd like. Or what I like to do is just put it in here into the original image line folder and into projects here in templates so let's let's because i think i went too fast so local disk um right into your c drive into your program folder image line um your version of fl studio that you're in at the moment this works for all fl every fl version i should say um go into data and projects from projects templates now these are all the same templates that are the same when you go up to file and you go to start with new template I'll go to, I think it's in minimal, um, empty is what I save mine to because I just like mine just straight empty. I don't like anything on it, um, but you can make one right in here or you can make one in one of these folders. So you can just go to other and then we'll say, um, or I'll just go to minimal um, and we'll say, uh, let's put it in empty and then we'll say this is uh, our starter call it the starter template now it'll save it and what will happen is now all we have to do is go into new template oh well let's close fl out first so now when we open fl studio up we can go to new from template minimal and we go down here to starter which is our template that we made so now i'm gonna click that starter there it is for you and now what will happen is when i close that fell out it'll automatically start up with these sounds the same thing the gladiator the the bomb the claps you know whatever sounds or whatever plugins or whatever you had in there it'll automatically start up and it also goes for the mixer too you can put something on the mixer track that you like if you have these added to a mixer track and you can save it with those specific plugins so if there's a you know your kick sounds a certain way you can have the kick set up already ready to go when you come in and, and get a get a beat going or a piano or a clap or these claps here you can have you know your eq on them or your reverb on them so that you basically have a beat built without building a beat if that makes any sense so hopefully that helped you guys today again you know you just go in add an add a start up a new uh fl uh file go add your sounds and then go into file save as and you go to computer Right into your local disk and your program files, you'll find the image line folder, FL, whatever version you have, minus 12. Go to data, projects, templates, and then save it in one of these folders or just make your own uh, template right in this area here. You can save it right there. And then again, once you've made it, you go here, file, new from template, open it up, close your FL out. And every time you open FL, it'll start right back up. Hopefully you guys found some value in this. Until next time. Peace.